So, hello guys, we're going to review the 2011 Hyundai i20. Let's get into it. Head out over to the back seats. Probably nothing normal, just mostly not leather seats. So, so mostly nothing normal. There's a cover that comes with it, but I took it off. The boot space, nothing mostly normal. Nothing normal space. So let's head over to the front seat. Heading that way over to the front seat. Okay. Let's get inside. So firstly you have there you can tell your mileage here. Yeah, I've it I installed that so it doesn't come with that but I have a trip one. How does nothing? Yeah, so you get a radio button, you get another button here, you get lots of these buttons. Best thing, when you need a call, you can use this, or when you need music, you need this in the channel. So it goes up to fourth gear, it's a manual, it has a spot for iPod. So, that's checking the cool roof box. Mostly have an extra storage here. You have stuff like put stuff in. Well, mostly normal stuff. Okay. Okay. So I have an airbag system here. I have a magnet that actually comes with it that you can stick your phone to. So you mostly have two. Three cup holders, put your stuff in, have a big compartment space there, you have a lot of storage here, you even have a space here, you can you do this. You can fold your mirrors and you can even extend your mirrors and you can change your windows, you can even lock your car and there's a special compartment there. So you can change settings here, so this is where the AC comes from. Four different kinds. Rear view mirror works. Let's bring it down to here. It has a little latch like a pull. You can see yourself. So you have this. You can put the light on. And. Ooh. The lights. So. There's a passenger one. It's a bit smaller one. So it's a bit hard to reach. So. It still works. Tells you warnings about the car. Most while you can have the window, you can lock that. Has some speakers coming from out the side. You can put them more speakers. They have the pedals, three pedals. Remember, three the spot from the back is this. Yeah, components here. When I'm speaking wrong, you go under there. So I need the, so there is a compartment that I can actually latch under there so it won't get stuck under your pedals. And you can even lock it and unlock it. I have some compartments. This one actually has no compartments here. You have a hatch for here, you have one here. You have airbags on the side. You got extendable headrest. You got seatbelt hackers, you got seatbelt, you got decent amount of leg room right here. You have something to extend your there. There's headbags here. And we have a horn there that has headbags in it. We have indicates for for wipers and lights. Then so you have AC units where you control the AC and you can change how windy you can put in zero to four. So then my most favorite part about this car is when I told you about the compartment. It's got yeah, a tank fuel on car horses. Okay, you can definitely tell this is not empty from the back. So open this open. Oh, so, this bag out of the way. 
I won't show you all of it because there's my dad's license plate under there. Put your license plate under there. There's a simple unit, so you can put your tyres underneath it. So if you need to put a tyre, you get lights all along here. You get a extendable latch. You can even get wipers that actually function. Let's go over to the front again. Okay. We have the Hyundai Logan here. We have a metallic, almost clean, nice highlight here. Another nice highlight here. And we have vents that go underneath it. Where's that? Yeah. We have indicators coming from the side. Again, nice mirrors if you clean them enough. You get non tinted windows. And perfect though. And you say, what about the tyres? You get Daniel Natty tyres from A65 and this from used is only two grand. You get two grand for this. I won't check you under here because I don't know what they're doing. Somebody just locked my door. I can't get back in. I have nice wipers here. The Hyundai logo here. You have the same here. If you leave the window down here, what it looks like from the outside. Same tire brand here with bolts here. And get nice, functional highlights. It performs super well. And my favorite part about this sensors that actually work when you clean them so two grand this hand to this day i never know how to open a guest up never know but it does function well so mostly this is the most cheapest car that i have ever had but not for that you can actually Unlock so if your key fob does not work, you can get your key fob, twist that open. But let me show you the best part about this car. You have a key. What key are you expecting? A key Bacanto X line. So let me show you the cool facts about this. You have a seven year warranty for this. Call right here, seven year want warranty. It's a girl from Nottingham Derby, currently 19 around on the market. You can get finger sensors to open this door. Or you have you have nice leather seats with heated warnings. You can even get the same amount, but you can change your wiper speed. You can get phone call things. You need to change that. Then you have air vents coming through that. Let's check the back. Tinted ball. Put your phone up there and see what's inside. Nice leather seats. Nothing normal, but packets. You can't see that. Packets. There. You have extendable thing that can go through. Nice futuristic of that. New Kia brand. And um, the best part about this. Can even tell what you what you need. So, warning right here. Nice wings on the mirrors. Um, no plan from that actually. As the key only just came out, I said I could pull this up. Let's do this. So, as I was saying, the new key key logo. No brand on the tire actually. So that's. I think these are here made. This was made in Japan. Uh, let's go into the back. Nice functional there. Cool. So the seven year warranty. So my mom got this for actually said two hundred pounds because so oh my god, what about this? Okay, good. Yeah, sometimes it doesn't work when you have the key. 
No. Okay. Time to hit the road while I honk. Forgot this book. Okay, that's fine. Okay. See you, world. See you in the next vlog. See you in the next vehicle. As I'm saying, we'll see you in the next car vlog. Um, next week, we're actually going to review car fully. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. And our goal is 880. When I get 880, I'll review a special car that is actually expensive to rent. So, if the, no, I'm going to change to 1k subscribers. I will rent a Tesla and review it to you, all you guys who are watching this. You know you? You watching this? Did you make it to the end of the video? Well, well, don't know. But as I'm going to stop, and I'll see you in the next vlog.